Ranger Stephanie. And I'm Ranger Claire. And we work here at Seven Island State Birding Park. And if you've been on a hike with us or seen some of our social media posts, we often imitate to the best of our abilities, uh, bird songs and bird calls. And many of you find it very amusing and entertaining and have made the request for more. And so we are going to do our best. And what are we going to do today, Claire? So we're going to start today with the namesayers. These are all birds that were named after either the song they sing or a sound that they make. So enjoy the video. So one of the bird species out here that is a resident that many of you will probably hear but not see is the northern bobwhite quail. What do they sound like, Claire? Well, <laughs> they sound like... Bob White, Bob White, Bob White. In my opinion, they sound more like <laughs> <laughs> And here is what a Bob White actually sounds like. You judge for yourself who does it best. All right, so the next namesayer is the Phoebe. The Eastern Phoebe is one of the flycatchers, and you often see them perched on branches or telephone wires, and they, one way to recognize them is their tail will be bobbing up and down. And Stephanie, do you wanna tell us what the Phoebe sounds like? In my opinion, it sounds like they're calling somebody named Phoebe, and they get really irritated, so they'll go, Phoebe? 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 <laughs> Phoebe? <laughs> Phoebe, Phoebe! <laughs> what do you think they sound like, Claire? Well, sometimes it sounds like they're saying, Phoebe, 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 Phoebe. <laughs> Here is an actual Phoebe singing. You be the judge who does it best. Another name sayer that we have here at Seven Islands is a year-round resident, and it is the Carolina Chickadee. And they are a cavity nester, and we will often find them making nests in one of our many uh, nest boxes throughout the park. What do you think they sound like, Claire? Oh, I'm good at this one. <laughs> the chickadee is chickadee dee 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 dee, chickadee dee 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 dee. <laughs> what do you think, Stephanie? <laughs> well, they actually will sometimes do two different calls or songs. They'll do the chickadee dee dee. And depending on how irritated they are, they might do more D's like chickadee dee 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 dee. Or, or just short little chickadee, chickadee dee. But I've also heard them go, Carolina, Carolina. But mm -hmm. here is an actual Carolina chickadee calling and singing. Again, you be the judge who does it best. <laughs> All right, so the next namesayer is the blue jay. And this is a bird you're all probably pretty familiar with, a big blue and white bird that can sometimes be aggressive. And these guys can make all kinds of noise. Sometimes they even mimic hawks. Um, but their namesayer call sounds like what, Stephanie? Jay, 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 jay. But they will also make a queedle call, as in my opinion, that's what it sounds like. Queedle, 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 queedle. Yep. What do you think they sound like, Claire? Well, the queedle call, I think, sometimes sounds almost like a car alarm. Um, in the J sounds, you hear them all the time. It's J, 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 J. <laughs> Here is an actual blue J calling. Again, you be the judge who sang it best. Another bird that we have out here that says its name is the Eastern Wood Peewee. And they will a lot of times be in the forested habitats. What do you think they sound like, Claire? Well, these birds are easily mistaken as a Phoebe. They look very similar until you hear them so their song, which is Peewee, Peewee, Peewee. <laughs> well, I 
think it's very pretty it's pretty close but i think they sound like peewee 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 <laughs> that's pretty good somebody <laughs> here is an actual eastern wood peewee singing you be the judge who sang it best All right, so our next bird is called the killdeer. And if you've ever wondered why they're called a killdeer, it's not because they kill deer. It's because they sound like what, Stephanie? To me, they sound like they're going, kill deer, kill deer, kill deer, kill deer. That's pretty good, but I don't always hear the whole deer part. Maybe it's more like, kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me. <laughs> Here's an actual killdeer singing. You be the judge who does it best. Another bird that you'll see out here at Seven Islands that you may see in your yards as well is the Eastern Tohi. And they get their name from the call that they make. Sounds like Tohi, Tohi, Tohi. But don't they also commonly sing, Claire? They do. So these little birds will tell you to drink your tea, drink your tea, drink your tea. <laughs> Here's an actual Eastern Tohi calling and singing. You be the judge who does it best. Well, we hope you've enjoyed today's uh, lesson about the namesayers and Look forward to some more sessions like this in the weeks to come about other groups of birds. And also, uh, please check out our Facebook page or our website for, to look for our upcoming programs, including a couple of um, programs scheduled on birding by ear that I'll be leading in the next few weeks. See you next time.